you know, a 564 ring makes about seven pounds of drag. Yeah. The oil ring, that 316 oil ring, makes about 20 pounds of drag. So yeah. a modern full-on racing ring, you know, 0 0.5, 0 0.6, 0 0.7 millimeter makes less than a pound of force. Really? And we're producing oil rings that are only three and four pounds of force. I can say this. You could take that one oil ring and take the whole engine's rotating assembly today, and it doesn't make as much tension as that oil ring did. A modern racing really? engine today, you can literally turn it over, no tools. Now, that's not for everybody. That's not street stuff, folks. No. That's, that's full-on, dry sump, pulling a vacuum, racing engines of today. Okay. But that same type of technology is in the modern engines. A modern LS engine yeah. runs ring stacks as thin as 1.2, 1.2, 2 millimeter. Yeah. So we've got oil rings in that are 7 pounds of drag versus 20 pounds of drag. Okay. Compression rings that are maybe... Two to three pounds of force versus seven and eight pounds of force, okay. and they're dry. Now, keeping in mind, again, we're back to clean sheet of paper engines yeah. that are designed around these rings. Can okay. I add some of that technology to the old school engines? Yes, we can, but we have to do it in moderation. 